Welcome back to my channel, Lady Survival here. Happy 2024. It is January 1st today that I'm filming this. Might not have it up by then, but it is New Year's nonetheless. I hope you guys had an amazing holiday season and New Year's and I want to make a specific video talking about the new year and all of my goals and plans for it, but today for the very beginning of the new year I have instead a Killstar unboxing. Uh, this one is actually a little bit different. A surprise box that I had no idea was coming. I'm not entirely sure what is in here. I like glanced at it because it sent me an email of like the order stuff. Um, so I think that there was like some hair dye and like some Christmas decorations and maybe lipstick but it was a while ago, a few weeks ago that I looked and I didn't really look at it for too long. So for the most part this is all going to be a surprise uh, Christmas gift from Killstar. I wanted to film this earlier like like actually you know like on Christmas Eve or something like that but it just got really really busy so uh, I'm really stoked to be opening it with you guys today I'm using my Frostmourne dagger to dive into this box and I think that this one will be really exciting because I don't know what to expect you know look at how cool this is it's actually like really exciting it says it's hexmas let's just dive right in I'm gonna start with whatever this thing is because it was like oh my god this is stalking a Killstar stocking. I know it might seem kind of silly that I'm opening this like so late. I don't know about you guys, but I personally like to keep Christmas stuff up till like February because I just like it. We also have a black Christmas tree, so it's pretty cool. Um, so I don't mind. I'm gonna hang all this stuff up. Any decorations that they sent me and just keep them up for a while. Ooh, that's so cool. Little sheet in there. Little black stocking. I love it so much. Check out the pattern on it. I love how like, is this huge or is it just me? It's like full on like, like a giant foot at the bottom, but this is so cute and so soft. Oh. Going back into the box, I see what I think is hair dye. Oh my God, four things of hair dye. Holy gosh, all seeing dye from Kelstar. Let me get these all lined up here. Look at how cute these are. Four hair dyes, what do we have? Blood Moon, Wolfsbane, Gothic Grape, and Go Gotia. It looks like there is like two kind of reds and two kind of purple colors. That is so cool and exactly my vibe. I don't know if they like specifically chose these for me knowing that I love red and purple, but oh my gosh, I've never tried Killstar dyes before, so I'll definitely have to give these a shot once my hair fades a little bit. And on the topic of my hair, I finally dyed my one set of hair extensions this plum color so i put that in today i'm kind of struggling to like blend it like there's kind of just this like chunk so i kind of try to like you know just kind of work it into the hair there but i do really like it having more of that like pinky color all throughout next thing this i have no idea what this is it's very heavy though it says Sava Sana tall glass candle oh my gosh oh that's so exciting i have no idea what this is going to look like but i'm so excited because i just set up this like little kind of wiccan altar behind me i literally did this just like an hour ago before i started filming um in 2024 i really want to try to get into more like spirituality and like Wiccan kind of stuff. So I got kind of excited because it's like New Year's and I have the day off work today because it's the holiday. And I was like, I'm just gonna try to make a little makeshift Wiccan altar with stuff that I have. I obviously need to buy a few more things. Like I need to get an incense burner and like a dagger, I think, I don't even know. But this candle will probably be perfect over here. So I'm really excited. Let's open it up and see. It's definitely very heavy. Ooh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, look at it. And it's a black candle too. It smells good, but unlike any candle I've ever smelled before, I like it though, that's awesome. Oh my gosh, I love the design so much. That is so pretty. I can't even wait to use that. I feel like I just wanna like put that right over there. I'll find a little spot for it. But for now, that's where it's going to go. I guess we'll keep the lid on it too. I love it so much. It's like the perfect addition. The next thing is uh, Killstar Haunted Homeware 
Hexmas edition, and it says, ooh, Christmas baubles, uh, decorations. Let's see what they look like. We've got four little ornaments in here. And the first one and see what we got. I don't know if they're like all the same or if it's different. Ooh, this is so cute. It looks like there is a bow that's supposed to be like glued on, so I'll just have to like re-glue it. I'm guessing it goes right there. Look at how cute it is though, even without the bow. That is just so adorable. I love it so much. Ooh, yep, looks like a different color. Maybe this one will have the bow so that I'll know where it's supposed to, to go. Okay, so it looks like it goes, yeah, right at the base. There is all four of them there. They're so cute. I also want to say the bow falling off. I think it was my bad because when I was opening the first one, when I was peeling this off, I kind of felt something like unattached. So I think that I was the reason why it fell off, but yeah. Oh my gosh, at the bottom of the box, I just found another hair dye. It looks like a pink and it's called Hell Kitty. So... I swear to God, the purple, red, and pinks, it's like they know what's going on here. Found our little card things at the bottom of the box, and there's also a few little small things. I don't know what these are. Oh, a pair of earrings and a hairpin set. Oh my gosh, look at how cute. Little hairpins, these are so adorable. Let's try one on right now. Let's pop this other guy in. I don't even know if I like line them up right, but look at how cute those are. Oh my gosh. They're literally so adorable. There's also a little star one, but I'm not going to put it in right now. In fact, I think I'm going to take these out just because I feel weird <laughs> with my hair pin back, but I will definitely find a cute way to style these into my hair. They're so adorable. The next thing is, I guess, a pair of earrings. Oh, they're just little studs. Okay, cute. I actually love that because a lot of the earrings that I have are super like long and dangly so I never wear them out because I feel like they're gonna rip on something. These are so cute. They look like little spider webs but they also look like little bat wings kind of. You know like it looks like little wings. I'm gonna put them in because I don't have earrings in. I don't know if you're like supposed to disinfect earrings first but we're just gonna put them in because why not. Hey, there we go. Got our little earrings in. They're so cute. I love how like just easy and simple they are. We are now almost done the box, except there is a box within the box. So I'm not really sure what's in here. There might be like makeup products maybe, because I do vaguely remember maybe seeing like lipstick stuff maybe. So I could be wrong. I don't even actually know what's in here. Ooh, looks like we got some tinsel. That is so awesome. Red tinsel. I'll definitely, I will definitely have to add this onto our tree as well. I hope that you enjoyed the unboxing, little Killstar Christmas edition. And I guess in the future, I will definitely have to do a video testing out the hair dyes and see how they work. Um, that'll be probably at least a month or two in the future because I'll have to wait for my hair to kind of fade out so I can try something new and see how these all work. I'm gonna go and hang up some of these Killstar decorations and hopefully film some B-roll for you guys to throw into the end of the video. But other than that, I'm gonna go now. So I hope that you all had a super good Christmas, super good New Year's. Let me know your like New Year's resolutions and goals and all that stuff down below. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.